summer camp was five days long, again like last year. Uh, it was really good fun, hell at times, but it was really good. We had um, two or three sessions, court sessions a day, and uh, one lecture a day. So we had, I think, media one day, um, psychology, nutrition. The highlight of my week was when Tamsin Greenway came to um, uh, one of the training sessions and uh, she's my um, one of my first idols. She plays the same position as me, wing attack, goal attack, and uh, she's England player herself. She's been in the senior squad for many years now and uh, she's a Surrey Storm Super League player. And uh, yeah, it, um, it was insane. She was just taught us how to absolutely destroy the defender on the centre pass, got some tactics and got some um, got the insight of her game. Some days it was attacking, sometimes it was defending, so we had different coaches. We had Denise, Colette and Jan taking the sessions. And um, yeah, it was. we just had a broad variety of training throughout the whole week. So I first started playing netball at my school, Truro High School for Girls, and I think I was year three. Uh, where Jill Trugais uh, first started coaching me and I don't know really I've just started you know taking the level up by up um, club to county to regional and um, I've just taken it stride by stride and here I am in England. It, it showed uh, from an early age from about 11 or 12 we started seeing that you had exceptional talent um, at Newquay <clears throat> about three years ago, she's now 15, and um, when she was 12 she was playing in an under-14 tournament. And we were coming out of the Air Dome at uh, uh, Newquay Triviglas, and uh, there was a, a couple of ladies uh, from up country, one from uh, Somerset, and I was walking behind Lottie and they didn't know who I was, and they tapped Lottie on the shoulder and separately uh, one said uh, it was well worth the 200 mile journey just to come and watch her play. And when you hear that as a parent, yeah, clearly you're proud and um, you, you glow. But um, you, you spot, particularly with the level of sport that Lottie have been playing, competing county level um, athletics and um, uh, everything from tennis, swimming, right through. But netball has always shone. She's, um, she's got a natural ball skill, uh, athletic um, uh, talent on the, on the court. I think ballet's helped, and um, I, I, it's with the movement. And uh, yeah, it's it, it's netball's just stayed with her all the time. And you just have to look at her face when she comes off court. She's this br br big, broad smile. I'm just ecstatic that it's Super League that I've be, even been invited to this weekend because you know it's only I'm only 15 and it's my third year going into Team Bath and when I first got the email I thought it was just NTL the National Talent League again um, invitation to go to the uh, trials but then I reread it and I was like wow it's Super League and um, it's just it's amazing because Super League is all um, it's on Sky it's on television and it's, just, it's wow <laughs> I think it's a much uh, faster sport than basketball uh, when it's played at the top level, I think everyone gets used to, you know, playing netball at school in the rain and the cold outside, but it's an indoor game and it's just the level when it's at the high standards is just insane. As a father, obviously, my first uh, interest is to see that she plays well. Um, I, I also want to balance that. Um, with her enjoying the sport you know she's got to love what she does because if she's going to commit what she's doing then she's got to stay with it and she's got to she's got to actually enjoy it all we know is that we've got some challenges uh, um, up and coming and it's just going to be great to get to know my idols you know joe bins um pam cookie everyone they just they help me so much um they're just as good as the coaches well obviously you know the coaches are amazing but you just take up, um, take everything on board so well because they've been there, they're at the place that I want to be and they're playing against all these defenders that just rough, uh, like you know, pinch your dresses and they say it's a non-contact sport but nah. <laughs>